welcome back to my channel and for anyone new here hi my name is rebecca and i do all kinds of fun and exciting makeup and fashion videos shopping videos and more so if you're interested in me doing a dollar tree makeup look full face of dollar tree makeup product so just keep on watching okay guys so i have a bunch of products that i got from the dollar tree and i obviously didn't get a full full face of makeup from the dollar tree but i did get um some good stuff some fun cool stuff so i will be doing a look with what the stuff i got so yeah there will probably be a part to this video because i do wish i found some of the wet and wild brushes but um yeah so let's start with step one my skin is all prepped and i did not buy any like skincare let me know guys if you're interested in me getting a skincare i'm going to be starting off with this bronzer drops obviously this looks like a dupe for the drunk elephant and they're super cute so i'm going to be trying these out first i almost forgot my headband so let's quickly put that on now my hair's pushed the back we can put the bronzing drops so Bronzing drops. Whoa. Okay. Just put put some more here and here. <gasps> okay. I might have put a lot, guys. But let's just. Okay. Oh my god. I think I put way too much. So let me just take some of this off, and I'll be right back. Okay. Now I took off some of it. I'm going to be blending it out because it looked insanely pigmented and I don't think I'd be able to keep it on my face. <laughs> like, okay, I don't know how I feel about this, guys. Why is it making me look red? I am very, very confused. But, I don't know. Let's just, oh my god, no. We're off to a really bad start. Am I doing something wrong? I've seen so many videos of people getting this and it's like looking amazing. I feel like I look just insane. Maybe if I mix it with a moisturizer, it'd be a little better. I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna apply some of my moisturizer. I'm gonna use my daily moisturizer that I use. So let's see if this fixes it. Cause I don't know guys. Okay, what do you guys think? I don't like this. It's so patchy. So this bronzing drops is a no for me. Okay, so let's try out this beauty blender. Maybe it will fix my face a bit. So this beauty bar has this infused with rose oil. Oh my god. It is. That is insane. It is really firm though. It's not soft or bouncy. But I'm just gonna... Wow, it's so not... I don't like that. It's so hard. My wet it, it'll be softer, but I kind of don't want to because of the rose oil in it. It's kind of like, oh, guys, it kind of feels wet when I squeeze it. But I'm just going to kind of like blend this out. Okay, guys, so I blended it out as much as I can with this beauty blender. So, yeah. Okay, next product I have is for next, I probably do bronzer. I don't have a skin tint or a concealer. Because I did not have my shade or any, like, good concealer. So, yeah. And they didn't have, like, a skin tint that I would... They didn't have any skin tints, honestly. I didn't see any. So, yeah. Or I did see one that was just, like, not my shade. I think that's what happened. But then I have this bronzer. And I know that they have a matte one. But they didn't have it at the store I went to. So, I have this shimmery one. Which kind of sucks. But I guess we'll try it out. But it's... Because I usually do, like, cream products and then powder. But I don't have a cream bronzer. But I do a cream blush. So, should I do blush first, then bronzer? Guys, I think I'm going to do that. But, guys, look how cute this blush is. I'm obsessed. So, the packaging is so cute and pink. Is this also... Guys, that literally smells... That literally smells like peaches that's actually amazing oh my god i'm scared i'm gonna break it but it's so cute let's test it out and just okay i think this might be glowy wow it's actually super glowy so let's just put this on my cheeks 
it's also like very um what's it called it's not so pigmented how i thought it would be because like look at this color it's so pretty it kind of feels like a balm like i'm gonna use the back of the speed blender to kind of blend it out guys i see no pigment what is going on dollar tree is what's going on with you i maybe i just didn't find the right products but guys this smells so good and so does this beauty blender this stuff is probably not good for my skin but i know the la colors products that i've got are gonna be good so yeah kind of sucks i didn't find the wet and wild um brushes but it's fine hopefully for my next video my next dollar tree video i will find it but guys maybe if i like put it onto my beauty blender guys i don't see this product at all let's try to just keep putting wow it smells so good though okay i think i got some color on here i hope i don't break out from this because it's so like i don't know how to explain it anymore but yeah okay on to the next product, which is bronzer. I'm going to go in this LA Colors Shimmer Bronzer. Oh, I love that. Okay. This is a good bronzer, guys. Give us a 10 out of 10. This is a super good bronzer. And it doesn't look too shimmery, I guess. They didn't have setting spray. So I'm just going to go on to eyes. I'm going to start off with using this eyeliner and kind of going around my eyes. And then I'm going to go in with this um, eyeshadow palette. So, yeah, let's start with this. I know I'm going to love this because it's LA Colors and they have amazing products. So, yeah. Okay, now that I look like a raccoon, that's my goal. And guys, this eyeliner is so good. The LA Colors one, amazing. For $1.25 it's just it's amazing it's so good now i'm going in with the palette 2000s eyeshadow palette I'm really excited and i'm going to be using the brush that comes in it since i don't have eyebrow so i don't have brushes so but this does come with a brush i'm going to be using this i can't open it for some reason okay guys look how pretty that i did just dig my nail into that but that's fine so pretty i'm gonna go in with i think first oh my god these are honestly so soft I haven't used one of these in a long time. But I think at first I'm going to just kind of blend out what I have and then I go back with the eyeshadow. Oh my god, guys, I did never realize how good these little brushes blend. They're this super soft sponge and it blends out amazing. Loki better than the brushes I have. I barely did anything. Maybe it's an eyeliner. I don't know, but it's so good. Okay, now I'm going to go in with a little bit of the black. And I'm just going to kind of like put on my brush a bit. And put it towards my outer feet. You guys, we'll see. Guys, first of all, look how pigmented that is. For LA Colors Daughter 25 palette. That's insane. Okay, and now for my, like, to use the gray, I'm going to go in with an eyeshadow brush just so I can, like, blend it out a little better. I'm going to use this one and go in with this pretty silver right here. Also probably so pigmented, but I use this as a transition shade. I keep forgetting. Look how pigmented that is. Oh, my God. Hold on. I need to blend this. I have to clean that up a bit because I didn't realize how pigmented that is. Oh my god, insane. You guys have to get this palette. Okay, now I'm going to go in with this white and I'm going to use this brush. And I'm going to just like... I already know it's going to be so pigmented. Put it right here. Oh my god. Do you guys see that? I'm literally speechless. That is so pigmented. 
Guys, I'm obsessed. I'm just gonna kind of blend it all in together. Okay, so next step, I think I'm gonna do mascara. So I'm gonna curl my lashes and do mascara, and this is the mascara I'm using. So excited to try it out. Hopefully, it's a good one. It's just, it's a volumizing mascara. So let's see if it's right. So should I curl my lashes or shouldn't I? Let's not curl my lashes and see what it does. Not find an eyebrow gel. So I kind of already did my brows before the video just so they're in place and not fluffy and flying around. Okay, let's see how the brush looks. Okay, interesting guys. Look at this brush. Honestly, that is such a nice brush. It has like a little curve. It is very flimsy though, but let's see how it looks i'm gonna come a bit closer so you guys can see okay so this is a before no mascara and this is an after with mascara i don't see the volumizing so much it like i have like um like see-through eyelashes but it took me like a bunch of coats to actually get this, which I don't like how it looks, but for $1.25, it's not the worst. So yeah, I'm going to quickly do my other eye and I'll be right back. Also, one thing, this feels super like dry. Like, I don't know. Like, I think I kept having myself dip it back into the tube. It feels like a really thick, did you guys see that? Really thick um, mascara. I Okay, I don't like this mascara. It has a weird smell. My eyes are low-key kind of feeling weird. I don't know if it's in my head or not, but yeah, this eye is just... I don't know. It feels really heavy, the mascara, for some reason. And it did nothing for my lashes. Like, nothing at all. Besides coat them in, like, thick-ass mascara. That's just weird. Feels weird. But the eyeshadow... I love so much obsessed with the product of it it is literally so good now on to my last step which is lips so i'm going to be using this lip gloss i'm so excited i really hope it's good i'm really scared because it's the same brand as a mascara but hopefully it's it, it's good it, it better be it's just a pretty color and the packaging is so cute too so guys look at it purple and the pink i love the purple packaging so let's see okay cute let's smell it doesn't have a scent which is honestly pretty good but let's see this shade <gasps> wait it's not sticky Oh my gosh, I think I just found my new favorite lip gloss. It's not sticky at all, and it's just like baby pink nudish color, and I'm obsessed with it because it's like a very, very like 2000s like lip gloss to put on top of a nude lip. This would look amazing. I'm obsessed with this. And it's, and it's not sticky at all, and I love it. Oh my god, guys. This is a 10 out of 10 lip gloss. And then I think they did have other shades. But this one just really, really, like, I just love the color of it. It's so pretty. So I got this one. Okay guys, so that's it for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. So please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below what kind of videos you guys would be interested in. And yeah, bye everyone.